Your PCB design doesn't start with your board layout. It starts with your schematic design. Every decision you make early in the design capture phase will directly impact your board design. With Altium Designer design rule directives, you can start constraining your designs by adding configurable parameters to your schematic source documents. You can add the design rule directives parameter on your schematic documents to a pin, port, wire, bus signal harness, component, or even a sheet document. Once placed, you can then add the PCB rule you need to the directive and then define the constraints for that rule. And if you need to expand the scope of your directive, simply place a blanket and then attach your parameter set directive. This allows you to specify design requirements to nets that fall within the bounds of your blanket, such as creating match length rules for a group of differential pairs. You can also place pre-configured differential pair directives to define differential pairs on the schematics. This will instruct the software to create a single differential pair object from each pair of directives. And when you want to check certain circuits in isolation from the rest of your design, as your design capture evolves over time, you can take advantage of the no ERC directive in order to suppress error checking for those circuits that you know will generate a warning. And when you're done with it, simply deactivate them. When you're ready to transfer your design to the PCB, the scope of the corresponding PCB design rule will then be created. Invest some time early on during your schematic capture phase with schematic design directives and get a head start on your PCB design before you even lay out a single route or place a single component.